What up, peeps? KJ Dizzy's in the building. I'm here to bring you guys some Last of Us Remastered tips and strategies. In today's video, I'm going to be giving you guys two best methods on how to take out the bloater on grounded mode. So without further ado, let's jump straight into the video. Now, starting off with the very first method, which is the fastest and the easiest, you're going to have to have two Molotovs and on top of that, two nail bombs. And when you have both of those, then we move over to the next step. Now, starting off with the second step, you're going to have to equip the Molotov and throw the very first Molotov at the bloater. When you throw the first Molotov at the bloater, make sure that you watch your surroundings and watch your back because there will be two runners chasing after you usually ellie and bill will take out both of the runners for you or one of the runners for you but if they don't take out one of the runners for you then just run around as the as the runners are chasing after you try to bring both of them to ellie and bill because as you bring both of them at least ellie and bill will take out one of them for you or at least have, have one of them occupy for you while the other runner is chasing after you while the other runner is chasing after you if you have enough time or if the uh if the bloater if the fire haven't extinguished out on the bloater make sure you take out that runner if you can it's not necessarily you have to do it but if you don't want to you know risk getting hit or getting grabbed by the uh by the runner and getting caught by the bloater when it's chasing after you then i recommend taking out the runner but once the fire once the first molotov runs out on the bloater take a equip the second molotov and throw it at the bloater and once you throw the second molotov at the bloater make sure that you equip the nail bomb throw the nail bomb at the bloater as well and that guarantee and it's a guarantee that the bloater will die with the nail bomb as as he's on fire but if it don't work with the first nail bomb, then use the second nail bomb. That's when the second nail bomb comes into hand. Throw the second nail bomb at the bloater, and it's a guaranteed kill for him. And I guarantee that you will win it with that very first method. And that is the first, and that is the easiest and fastest method that you can do if you have Molotovs and if you have a nail bomb. You can do it with just one nail bomb and one Molotov, but you might have to shoot them up a couple of times. But it won't really take too much to do it. But that's how you do it with the very first method. Now, starting off with the second method it's basically from the last video that i did five years ago but i'm going to get in deep detail with this method and it's going to be very very easy and this method should take you no longer than five minutes maybe less than that if you're really good at the game now what you're going to have to do all you have to do is just shoot them uh shoot the bloater in his spores there there's three spores that you have to shoot them in and three of them are located one of them is located at the hip and the second one is located at the shoulder and then the third one is located on his back I recommend using the Magnum and the shotgun because they are probably the strongest uh, guns that you can use, and it's a lot easier to take them out with that. So I recommend shooting him, shooting him in the spores with the Magnum because it's way easier. And on top of that, the crosshair is a lot smaller to take to take the shot with. So make sure you shoot him in the spores. And if you do tend to run out of ammo, then that's when the runners come in handy. So as you're running out of ammo, make sure that you watch your surroundings and dodge the runners because the runners will chase after you and they will try to hit you. So as you're as you're running away and um, running away from not only the the runners and uh, running away from the bloater, make sure that you get the runners from a good distance away from the bloater so you can beat up the blow uh, so you can beat up the runners and take them out easily. Once you take out the runners, they will tend to drop you some more ammo to take out the bloater. But sometimes ammo don't usually drop all the time, so make sure you just continue to run around the gym as much as possible and try to avoid the spores and try to avoid uh, the bloater chasing after you. And then just continue to wait, and then I guarantee more runners will spawn in and then all you have to do is just complete and do the same method over run around the gym take out one of the runners and like i said if two of them are chasing after you make make sure one of them run towards ellie and joel i mean run, make sure make sure you run to ellie and bill my bad for that run towards ellie and bill and it's a guarantee that they will take out one of them for you so when you take when you take them out take out one of them just go for the next one and pick up the ammo and then once you're doing that once you take out the spores and shoot the spores on the bloater just make sure i recommend taking out the shotgun because it makes it a lot easier and faster to shoot him so it should take about maybe roughly maybe four to five shots to take him out if you run out of ammo with the shotgun just make sure you take out the magnum I, I guarantee that the shotgun will take out the bloater a lot faster or it'll make his health go down a lot faster so make sure you shoot him with the shotgun and then switch over to the magnum shoot him up and it's a guarantee you'll win it just like that and then the method only takes about around five minutes maybe 10 at that it all depends on your skill but make sure you also dodge Bill and Ellie because I guarantee you will get stuck on them if they don't get out the way. So make sure you try to keep a good distance away from them as well. You only go towards them when you want to get two of the runners off of you. So make sure you keep your surroundings and continue to keep dodging. And I guarantee you will win this and you'll easily take this and you'll easily 
you know beat this beat this uh beat the bloater with this method so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys enjoy it and these tips are uh, and, and these tips were useful for you make sure you hit the like button and on top of that subscribe if you have not already i will be bringing you guys a lot more videos and if you have any if you need any more help with this video or any more help with this uh with the boss make sure you comment below and i will be giving you guys some detail in the comment section below as well but i will be bring you guys a lot more videos and on top of that if you guys want to i am going to be I'm, I'm going to be bringing a lot more dope uh, last of Us tips and strategies as well. So if you guys want to see more tips and strategies from last of Us, make sure you know you comment below. Let me know, and I will be guaranteed to bring you guys a lot more videos. So I hope you guys enjoy it. More great videos coming soon. And also on top of that, uh, you guys can watch watch me. You know, take out the bloater with the other methods that I do have, and on top of that, watch me fail miserably. So I hope you guys enjoy it. More great videos coming soon. And I'll see you guys in the next.